What's up guys, it is I, once again, Mr. Gamer 990 and welcome to another part of our Let's Play series on Telltale Games The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 2, whatever the title may be and we're gonna find out. So let's begin Episode 2 of Telltale Games The Walking Dead Season 2, A uh, House Divided, cool, here we go. I love the uh, small sound effect with the bird or crow or whatever it was. I think it was a raven. I just like to think it's a raven because of Vulcan Raven from Metal Gear Solid 1. One of the most cool looking bosses in history, you know? Along with the walking dead. Sniper Wolf and Revolver Ocelot. Clown. I'm freezing. Yeah. Wait till we get up to Wellington, then talk to <laughs> me about cold. Pretty cool. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! <laughs> I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. Oh, Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I wonder now, look, dearie. I'm thinking about moving on. Yeah? Well, yeah. you're welcome to stay here if you want. That's our choice. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Mary and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's hmm. Carver? You'll find out, honey. You will. You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Mm -hmm. ah! I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God it damn it. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here. Both of you. Get your asses. I love how he does that. Gangster style. Yeah. Waste of ammo. God damn it! Nick! Bye bye, Nick. We have See to you go. on the other side. If he lives through. And hopefully he won't because I hate Nick. I mean, uh, I hate many people in the Walking Dead series, but Nick, he can go fuck himself and his dead mama and his dead daddy because Uncle Pete ain't so happy. Wow, it rhymes. Daddy and uh, happy. That was very unintentional. Ooh, wow. That sound effect though, I love it. We want some meat. Some meat of Uncle Pete and Clementine. Oh yeah, maybe. Well, they shouldn't be able to get through that. Oh, they won't. On the downside, we can't get through them. Or so we think. <laughs> Look at inside. They will. In due time. Tick tock. Tick tock. Yeah. What are you looking at? You're bitten. That's exactly what we're looking at. Your room. Staring ain't polite. What are you gonna do? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? Well, other than this bite, I'm just peachy. Peachy. Yeah. He looks so uh, sweet. Hand me that there. Like peach. Dude, it won't work. It won't. Cutting it off won't Cutting work. Cutting it off won't work. Yeah. Says who? I me. knew someone who tried it. Yeah. Just because it Sad. didn't work once don't mean it can't work at all. Dude, try it if you can. Lee had the balls to cut his own arm or have Krista cut his arm, but can you do it on your own? Really? In front of a little girl? Huh. You can't. Out like a stuck pig. See? What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Wah, wah, Hell. Wah. <laughs> just... Me? Just give me a minute. Cool, bro. Try to get some rest. Take the time. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. Yeah? I love how deadpan uh, Clem's, uh, you know, her expression and dialogue is. It's like she really doesn't give a fuck. 
then again, she's so used to this world, I really can't blame her for being so dead and the way she's talking. And uh, car keys want to shit to this vehicle. Yes. Yeah, uh, let's check the radio or radio. <laughs> Sorry about the bad pronunciation there. I say it in French style. I love my French. say and open the box. What's the type of box? Brilliant gold. What's in there? Anything we can use? Yeah. Cigar. Really? You want Probably smoke? Tastes like pine tar about now. The gross. Right, smoke a dead coon you shouldn't. Steel, like that one. Yeah. You shouldn't. Why? <laughs> They're gonna kill me? Dude. Smoke. Give me those. Smoking's not good for you, old man. You got a light? You want to uh, die of uh, cancer caused by smoke? Up to you, brother. I warned you. Yeah? And uh, give him a light. There we go. <laughs> well, that tastes about as bad as it smells. Oh, yeah. No, we wait. Exactly! We wait. Guys, I seem to think the way these characters do in the Walking Dead series, whether it's season one, two, or, or the upcoming three, it's really weird how I think the same as these fools, but that's how uh, real human beings would think and uh, what they would do or what they want to do in these kind of situations. Oh, yeah. I fit perfectly in this world, you know, with the zombies and survival and uh, all the hunters that are after human beings. If I have the balls to do so, I have more balls than Pete and definitely more balls than uh, pussy ass Nick, that's for certain. And uh, we need to uh, check on Uncle Pete. Uncle Pete, are you alive? Don't be dead. Don't please. be dead, please. Yeah. <laughs> wow, shock factor. Oh, yeah. Oh, damn it. Uh, I feel like 10 pounds of shit in a 5 pound sack. <laughs> yeah. You look like shit. Jesus. Stuck in this can the whole damn day. See ya. What can we you do? You hear something funny? Why not? I've been thinking. And I don't want to die. <laughs> what do you fucking do? Wow. Join the club, man. <laughs> I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. Exactly. <laughs> there it is. Fool. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, okay. I'm scared. You're going to be okay. <laughs> oh, at least spare me the bedside bullshit. False hope. Yeah. Sorry. Would you... Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? Oh, I boy. stupid kid. No matter what you think, he is a good boy. I He's really playing a can't game. promise he anything. Honestly, boy. I can't. I can't make any promises. Yeah. Honest. He might be. Yeah. Been almost a day. They ain't gonna find us. Because honestly, what should I promise him about Nicky Where boy? Are you going? The fact that he might uh, get the group killed. Uh, he's a liability, he really is, and uh... I'm not getting out of this. Okay. You're gonna have to make a break for it. Oh, really? You I'll won't... buy you some time. Dude, you won't do shit, you're coming with you're me. You're coming with me. To do what? Die a couple hours later than now? To say goodbye to Nick. Huh? Wow. Well... Alright. <laughs> I'll try. She had to use the N word, well, Nick. Like my daddy used to say, <sighs> we're burning daylight. Yeah, your daddy is right. Let's get this over with. Indeed, he is. Yes, sir. Red and gold. Is that the brand or a company? Cool. And we need to avoid the zombies and make our way through the woods. Run, honey! Oh, wow. Oh man, off to a good start. Oh yeah. Go on now. Find my nephew. Dude, uh, uh, you have to try. You have to try. God damn it, go! Okay. It's your funeral. Whoa. God damn. 
That was a close one. Yeah, it was. That's actually a line from uh, Biker Mice from Mars. It's a really cool cartoon show I used to watch as a kid. No morning with the picture of Clem and the achievement episode 2 and how's divided. But Biker Mice from Mars is a really cool, uh, fun show. I love it a lot. And we're back in the cabin. And uh, what's inside the cabin? I don't know. Oh, these people. These fools. Including handsome Clement, Are you alright? And the bitch. No snow uh, with you? Where's Alvin? Rebecca. What happened? It's been hours. Uh, Where are they? Clem! He got, got bit. What? What happened? Walkers. My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Get the guns. Wow. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. I understand. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? Sure thing. She's upstairs. Just distract her. And don't tell her anything. Just, Just go. go. Hurry. Yeah. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. I'm not going to promise him anything like I didn't promise Uncle Pete about protecting that uh, pussy neck. Because guys in this world, especially knowing Telltale, no matter what Thank choice... You. You make cheese, they're all I gonna die. Was under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's inevitable. They will die. And they will turn. It's so cool. Yeah? Take one of me. So cool. Come on, take one of me. Like these two. Sure. Why not? BFFs. Give me a good pose, oh yeah, okay? baby. So cute. I mean they should include okay, uh, they should include uh, me and then we'd have like uh, three What's wrong? uh um, uh, three my girls dad? or three friends. Two girls, one dude. He'll be fine. He should know what's going You're on. Me. Yeah, she you should know. You should know what's going on. Yeah. He told you not to tell me, didn't he? Yeah. He is in trouble. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh. He is. She has what to know. Uh, everyone's gone. Uh, Pete's dead. Uh, what's going on? What's going everyone's on? gone. It's bad. Yeah. She has to know, guys. It's hard to sum up, but she has to know whether she likes it or Sorry, not. I, I just need to... Process. It's fine. Breathing. I understand people who've dealt with these kind of, uh, you know, uh, issues and just not being able to stomach these kind of things, so it's understandable. She's still in shock a bit. We're gonna comfort her. You wanna her. see what I found? Yeah. Why not, honey? Show us. Whoa, that's a fucking gun! Will you show me how to use it? No, whoa, whoa, whoa. I couldn't find any bullets. If yeah. something's wrong, I should know. Okay, but it's what not a toy. What if I have to use one? It's okay. Not, it's not a but toy. It's not a toy. Exactly. I know. Yeah. First, remember, it's just a thing. Yeah. What does that mean? Like Lee? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I thought it'd be heavier. Lee? Okay. What do I do? The most important thing is when you go to shoot, Take a breath before you pull the trigger. Breathe in, out. Not, Not like that. Big. Yeah. In, out. Should what should I shoot? Herself. Don't whoa, whoa. do that. So sorry. Calm sorry. down. It's okay, honey. Calm down. Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Oh, wow. We sure hey, how to back. defend herself. That will come in handy. Because, guys. She has to understand the world that we're living in, or that they're living in. If uh, she dies, it's because of Carlos. He didn't told her. And I hate uh, parents like that who don't tell their children until the last minute. The longer you wait, the uh, quicker they will die. And it's really sad if Sarah dies. I really don't want her to face uh, that kind of fate. Nick can go fuck himself, but Sarah is still a little girl. So uh, she deserves better than this. And we should try to avoid that uh, fucker over That's there. That's not Luke. No, it's not. It's not Clem, Luke. I think I know him. Carver. Fucking he Carver. Can't see me. You have hide. to make him go away. Go Don't hide. Find somewhere to hide. Yeah. Right now. Where? Let me see. The Clem, bathroom. I can't breathe. 
I can't, I can't breathe. The bathroom. Bathroom. The, uh, she has to hide. Hello. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's talk to this fucker. We talk to him. Uh, we lock. Shit. Hello there. Uh, who are you? Who are you? Well, actually, I'm your neighbor. Neighbor? Huh? That's right. That's right. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. Huh? What's your name? Michael Madsen. The actor who's voicing Carver is Michael Clementine. Madsen. Clementine? Well, you look just like Carly. Clementine. <laughs> Carly from season one. You mind if I come in? Clementine. I've been out all morning. This heat has got me. Oh. Good. No, I guess not. Well, I uh, love Michael Madsen. Really awesome it's actor. Nice place. Is there anyone else around? Reservoir Dogs. You usually see cabins. This Kill big Bill. Out. I'm alone. I'm alone. Wow. Really? Yeah. I take care of myself. Yeah. Well, I'm impressed. Huh? I'm staring him down. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. Seven of them, They've yeah. been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. No, we have Farm boys and an old man. <laughs> Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Yeah, taller. Big black guy. All people to This big. Yes. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. <laughs> wow. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. I'm sure. I'm really sure. And uh, they don't want to come back with you. Sorry, Carver. It's just how they feel. And I can't blame them, to be honest. What do you want exactly with them? A lot of plates for one person. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah. I don't ever do the dishes. Yeah, well, yeah. believe me, I don't either. Yeah. Should we do the He's passing through. Wow. He's been here a while. Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north yeah, looking yeah. for Shangri-La. Where do you Where live? Do you live? Yeah. Uh, down by the river there. Uh, There's a sweet little spot with a boat where we pitch camp. Got you. a few tents up and everything else. How long have you been there? Like I said, I'm surprised we haven't run into each other. How long have you been there? Been there for a good while now. Oh, really? oh I, I love it. <laughs> Her expression. Oh yeah, priceless man. And uh, looking at the knife. Make it more obvious, why don't you? Where does this go? Uh, over there. Uh, in the drawer there. Well, I have no idea how Clem's able to be composed. I mean, uh, she's a lot tougher and thick-skinned than uh, Sarah, but Sarah isn't, you know, tough. Well, this is a real nice place. Kind because of of her father. Her father is at fault here, if you ask me. It's not Sarah's fault. And I, really I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Feel bad for her. Doctor. Doctor Carlos. Real smug, son of a bitch. What, what, happened, what to happened to him? Let's just say we had our differences. Yeah. Sooner or later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Happens every time. I'm sure. And I think he has his reasons, which well, never well, stated. Well, in trouble. Yeah. The queen or the king? Three moves away from checkmate. Yeah, the king. Three moves away. Who's that? And uh, Carver is the king of uh, the opposite side. And we are uh, close to being checkmates or mated. I thought you said nobody's here. By Carver. And nobody is here. Nobody is here. Yeah. I think differently is what Carver is, uh, you know, thinking, and he's going to go up and check on who that someone is. Carver is nowhere near as intimidating as Big Bad Negan from the Walking Dead TV series and the comics, especially the comics, because he's like a cool guy, especially since he's voiced by Michael Fassbender, an actor I adore, but I he ain't you, scary. Nobody's here. No? Seems that way. And I say especially a lot, I know. You couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Dread sure. Dreadful habit, sorry. Using the word especially, like many other words. And uh, he's going to find Sarah. No, he didn't. Too bad. 
That smile. Who's this? Uh, my sister, she said. It's a kid. Must be someone who lived here. Must be. <laughs> you have no idea who these people are, do you? How do you know them? Do you know them? Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? Not much. Uh, he trusted me. Well, they locked me up in a shed. If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? Mm. This... Can we call Pete a friend or someone? Well, I think you... I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Really trust us? I don't know. Don't come. Who are you? Wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. Wow. He never told us his name, but we know who that is. Uh, the intruder. Intruder! Yeah. Silver what trophy. He? He He's gone. gone. He'll be back. Oh, he will. What if he comes back. He's going to, honey. Carver ain't dumb. I mean, he's not scary, but he ain't dumb. And uh, he's going to wreck hell on the group. Oh, yeah, baby. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. I meant to say unleash Clementine. hell, not wreck Sarah. hell. What the fuck does that mean? You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? Man. What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. I didn't calm open down? the door. I am calm. You calm down. What? I didn't Fuck open you. the door. He just came in. Both of you. He's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Why do you care so much? Yeah. Excuse me? Look, Clem, just Excuse tell me? us what he looked like. Fuck you. What was he wearing? Did he sound deep, uh, different? He had a big coat. brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. Carver. He talked about you, Dad. Carver. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy. Or not nice. Right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? Oh, yeah. He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Huh? Carlos. What? Uh, you I need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. I took the picture. It's my fault. Yeah? No, I asked her to. It's my fault. Take a responsibility. Sarah. Sarah, sweetie. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. I'm sure. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Yeah. Well, he, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Skedaddle. Alvin, wait! Yeah. Alvin we have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more time. bad guys. But it's gonna he's be smart. okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. Carver. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. Mm -hmm. We were lucky to escape. Look, I love... I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. I love smart have villains. have to leave. I do. And Carver isn't smart or unhinged we like... We have to find Pete. We we'll came on the way out, Nick. But... Clementine, you know where he was, right? He yeah. has. All right. Everybody grab your stuff, let's hit the road. He has his charming qualities, and I love my villains who have charming qualities and are quite seductive. Moving you said on. It was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey Clem, sorry if I gave you some shit back there. Finally. I'm just a little on edge. She apologized. It's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. I can handle it. It's okay. If it's not you I'm yelling at lately, it's Alvin. And then I'm in real trouble. Yeah. I can handle it. I'm not a little kid. Yeah. I felt the same way when I was your age. My dad was always giving me shit. And I always thought he didn't know a damn thing. Damn thing. Yeah. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes yeah. it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. 
You're damn right, I'm not honey. Used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. Yeah. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Yeah. You Alvin do and that. I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God <laughs> help me. Yeah. Any ideas? I Plan? don't know. You figure it out. I mean, you're the adult who can't really depend on herself, so uh, you try to uh, sort your own issues out, uh, honey, uh, bus or van. Yeah. That's where we were. Where uh, Pete is. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. So, search. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. Yeah. I'm trying to find him. Uncle Pete. And a blood trail. Yeah, he's dead, guys. I am certain he is dead. Oh, yeah. Fan out. Uncle Pete! <laughs> uncle Pete. Wow, uh, Nicky boy really wants his uncle Pete. back. It's like uh, Will Smith from The Fresh Prince of Bel Air and his uncle, uh, what's his name? Uncle Phil, yeah? Oh my god. Like I said, they all what died. Happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. Carver. Who did this? Carver's boys. Son of a bitch. We need to go. Yeah. We need to go. He's gone. Nick, he, he's I love, gone. I love his his panic accent. Come on, man. We need to go right now. Long time. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I love accents like those. It's pretty funny. But uh, he's handsome too, so I'll give him that. And uh, so long, Uncle Pete. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. He saved my life. He saved my life. Well, that was... that was Pete. Yeah? I'm sorry. He was asking for it, so it doesn't really matter. And Nick's depressed. Wow, wow, wow. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? Oh, yeah. boy. Sorry, you still want to come with us? Another promise. Look, uh, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any start. promises it won't get rougher. Uh, but we all know you now. Yeah, I'm with you guys. <laughs> and we are glad to have you. Not everyone is. We won't well, find. They'll get there. Krista. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, that's if how they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. That's how Telltale are. It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep yeah. moving now. It's our only choice. Indeed, it's our only choice. And Carver is going to catch up. Just like how uh, Uncle Pete died because it was inevitable, Carver is going to find us and he's not going to be happy that we ran away from him, the leader of uh, these people who used to be a part of his community, his group. And that's a sexy looking bridge, yeah. Not nearly as sexy as the bat of Big Bad Negan, my man Negan. His bat being Lucille. Oh yeah, that's how you say it, Lucille. And Lucky boy. Let's see. <coughs> Binoculars. See anything? Just fine. Walk for it, damn Yeah. Man. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. Yeah. Quite big. Sounds like a good place to spend the night. Yep. And uh, look Here, that. Beat this bed. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? It must be that ski resort. Yeah. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. <laughs> no. I imagine it wasn't. And uh, we need to look at the uh, damn woods. Wait, what's that? It's the... Uh, Station There's a house. little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. Yeah, and the bridge? There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I, I don't think, think so. so. Yeah, yeah, you think so, but that means it's not. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Yeah. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're going to be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but 
Look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. It gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. Hello. She's, she's what? Insane. She's just a little girl, Luke. Do it! I can do it. Wow. See? No problem. It's a little girl. It's gonna be I fine. Mean, hey, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch it's... for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. Yeah. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? Yeah. If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. If Chuck mentioned once in uh, season one of The Walking Dead how uh, if hey, you treat uh, her. Sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. Her being clam. I'm just still on edge after the Carver thing. I'm sure. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? If you treat her like a little girl, she's it's gonna die like one. So you have to train her what how to survive. Family. Family. Yeah? It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Yeah, of course. Even now, we can't trust uh, Anyways, you, that. You can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. Unless We've all made mistakes. We know someone. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's like. past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. The yeah, but guys, honestly, you need to try to uh, uh, teach uh, someone you love to be able to uh, mm. protect themselves against all dangers. Can't shoot them. Too much and, noise. Uh, we need to, uh, there are only two. Have, have Let's take them. Yeah, I like your style. Yeah, I'm sorry about my uh, confusing commentary right I'll there. I'll take the big one. You get short. It's hard to commentate when there's Which so much going on. We should be big okay. one. I've got the big one. Yeah. Hey, kid. Teamwork, baby. Kid. It's teamwork. Not like I don't know you have guts, but are you crazy? <laughs> Maybe I am. Have faith, Luke. Just have stick faith. with the plan, okay? <laughs> Luke, calm down. clem has been through far worse. Oh yeah, the hammer. It's hammer time. Oh yeah. Paying tribute to Tyrese. <laughs> to, to Tyrese. Oh. And, uh, heck. there we go. Go ahead. Give it a good pull. It yeah. should come free. Yep. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. <laughs> oh, boy. Wow. You go fuck yourself, Luke. You and the group. And, uh, need to sweat. Ooh. That ain't pretty. Nice work, kid. Ow. Ow. Exactly. Wow. One mind, guys. One mind. <laughs> that is scary, man. How we share one mind. It's like I'm Jinx in a way with these characters, only I'm not in danger over the bridge. Yeah. It's like that uh, Johnny Cash song. I think the song is Over Troubled Water. It's a really cool song, and for some reason, when I read Over the Bridge, it reminds me of Johnny's song. It's really fun, it's really cool and hip. That's the end of the first part to our Let's Play series on Telltale Games The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 2. I forgot the title, sorry, but look forward to the uh, second part. And if you guys enjoyed the video, please like, comment, subscribe if you wish and until next time peace out take care adios amigos au revoir and sayonara